The transatlantic slave trade refers to the exchange of goods for human labor that took place across the Atlantic Ocean from the 16th through to the 19th centuries. The practice mostly existed within sub-Saharan Africa. The Great Return Project, being spearheaded by Prophet Peter Anamo, is targeted at bringing people of African origin in the diaspora together to promote economic growth in Ghana and Africa. The Great Return takes the form of the biblical return of the Israelites who had spent several years in slavery in the country of Egypt to their homeland Canaan. Prophet Anamo believes that his initiative of the Great Return forms part of God's great plans of making Africa take her place in world affairs. The exodus of the former slaves was dubbed the Exodus, which the world knows about. The latter which is about to take off shall be called the Great Return. The essence of this divine enslavement is always to send the inhabitants of the spiritual center to a more developed and advanced nation to acquire knowledge. He used the occasion to re-emphasize an earlier prophecy he made concerning a tragedy of international scale that will soon befall the world. Ghanaians are more into political matters. Instead of going closer to God to play, pray for the politicians so that they can do better, we are busy praying by criticizing them. The whole world, when Ghana takes her place in the fourth center, will come and demand from Ghana very soon. The whole world will come here. And when they come, they will say, what does the Lord say? Prophet Anamo advised that Ghanaians must prepare themselves for the great return by meditating day and night on the word of God. Great return was revealed to me as a prophet in 2006. And I couldn't move because the time was not yet due. I was just informed. I was to study the Bible, get more information related to physical happenings. Until now that it was time. Michael Otimetro News, Accra.